we've got some soldering out here in the wild. This is called flat lock, where you basically take metal shingles, copper shingles, and then solder all the joints. Looks like this. And I want to show you the difference between a good weld and a less than ideal weld. Um, this looks really nice, but can you see this crack? Okay, got a crack there, so that can leak whenever there's a hole or a crack. And let me show you another one. This one, this one broke apart because we were walking on it, but a properly done solder joint will not break apart like that. The reason these are cracking is because if this is a seam, they they soldered across the top of the seams to, to stitch the two pieces together. Well, the strength is only as strong as the solder itself, which is pretty strong, but not strong enough to not crack when you walk on it like that. The real strength comes when you get the solder between the layers underneath this one. And there's, a, there's techniques and ways to do that. Um, it's called sweating. And that's where all the strength comes from. When you get that solder sweated between these layers underneath this, that's not going to break apart.